This is Corey Gerard, your tour guide again. And I'm coming back to you in Garden City, Michigan at the famous A to Z cards, comics, and coins. And I'm here to introduce you to a local Westland celebrity who's working here in Garden City by the name of Michael Woolley. And Michael is an artist and writer who has his own comic book series, which has now reached issue number four. So let me introduce you to Michael. Hey, Corey. Hey, how you doing, Michael? Doing good, man. How are you? I'm good. Hey, I heard a rumor that you got a lot of cool stuff to show us today. Yeah, I brought us some artwork we can check out and yeah, we can pimp my comic book and Okay, that would be stuff. that would be good. Let us see what's happening over here. Right. Yeah, Melted Wax Publishing, that's my uh my company that I publish my, my comic book through. Um Oh, you have your own publishing company. Yeah, right? yeah, do all the the distributing and the, all that stuff myself. Okay. The end of it. Yeah, that's the good i That's the general idea if you want to keep most of the money, right? Yeah, yeah. And then I own all my own characters and. Okay, so you, so you pride yourself on one hundred percent ownership yeah. of your brand. Yeah, do it yourself for sure. Okay, let us see what else right. you got going on, Mike. So let's uh, grab this portfolio here. All right. Okay. So that's uh, this is Cromwell Green. That's the name of my comic book. He's the main character. Okay. Um, it's kind of like he's a, so like a gothic kid that solves mysteries, kind of like Scooby Doo, but Scooby Doo meets a Kevin Smith film. It's kind of what we're going for. Okay. Um, well, it sounds yeah. like you're doing it your way. Here. Yeah, yeah, kind of its own thing. Now, how um, long have you been doing work like this, Michael? I've been drawing pretty much since I was a kid. Um, been doing comic stuff for the last few years. Um, working at a comic shop definitely helps for inspiration. Okay. I don't get a lot of ideas when I come to work. Okay. You have aspirations to go out in Hollywood and do graphics for some of the film yeah, well, and sure, television be, companies? Yeah, that would be awesome. Okay. Yeah. Anything, other comics, stuff, yeah, anything. Okay. What else you got here? All right. Now this is going to be... Looks real colorful. Yeah. Yeah. Going for different colors. Okay. Now, what is your inspiration for doing work such as this? Yeah, I just grew up a huge Star Wars fan. And then I started reading comics as a, late, as a young kid. Just always loved comics, always loved drawing. And just kept at it, man. Just something that, just in my blood, I love doing it. Yeah, I feel the same way. Comics are a constructive way to spend your time yeah, well, as well sure. as your money. For sure. Yeah, I love reading them. I love drawing them. Okay, let's see what else you got, man. Yeah. Um, there we go. Some good ones here. Yeah, this, Whoa. Is, uh, this is Delilah. She's one of our main characters. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's kind of like our, our poster girl for the melted wax for the company. Yeah, she looks to be scary sexy. Yep, that's both, totally what we're going for. Both at the same time. <laughs> Her name is Delilah. Delilah. Yep. Oh, okay. That has a biblical reference to it, right? Yep. This is nice right here. Oh, thank you. So what else do you got in the works besides your comic book series? Yeah, do, uh, we're doing the next issue. It's coming out early spring next year in 2019. And then just doing more artwork and more, I do commission work. So if people that are looking to get, like if you want a drawing of whatever character you want, um, you can hire me to draw. Okay. To draw characters. Um, okay. Marvel, DC, whoever you want. Okay. So you work on commission. Yep. Yep. I do commissions. Okay. Do you have some type of website where people can go on, into and see your work? Um, if you go on, yeah, if you go on Facebook. And look up, uh, yeah, the, yeah, Melted Wax Publishing will come up in the search. Melted Wax yeah. Publishing. Yep, yeah. and then there's also, we have a page for um, Cromwell Green. He has his own page for the comic. Okay. Because these are pretty well put together. Thank you. 
And I see you pride yourself on professionalism. Yeah, a lot of detail. Try to come. On, I gotta mm -hmm. see more, Michael. Cool. Let's keep looking. There's some more shots of Delilah. Whoa. Yes, Delilah is going to be a fan favorite. Yeah, I hope so. Nice, nice. Right, a couple more. This is on the back cover of uh, issue number four right here. The back cover of issue number four. Oh, yeah. Are you going to close the whole thing out, you know, at a certain amount of time, or are you going to keep the issues ongoing? We got a lot of ideas. So like, I'd like to keep it going. Um yeah, right now we're doing like single issue stories. Then later on, I like to build it into like some longer story arcs, some different uh, some different ideas we got brewing. Yeah, this reminds me sort of of the Adams family. So it looks oh, like yeah. you could turn this into a, a nice television series. Yeah, I'm a fan of uh, yeah monsters, Adams family, all that. Anything by uh, Tim Burton. I'm a huge Tim Burton fan. Yeah, you and me both. I grew up on the stuff as well. This looks to be Egyptian. Yep, that is um, Cleopatra. She's in issue number four. Okay. You kind of skip around, jump around, do different. Uh... Or it's, it's your particular take on Cleopatra, yep, right? Exactly. Okay. See more of Delilah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Some other some Cromwell Green characters here. Michael, do you do any collaborations or, you know, you or you prefer to work alone entirely? Um, yeah, I do collaborate with people from time to time. You know, if it's a cool idea, I'm down for it. Okay. Yeah, we even great artists need others to draw yeah, inspiration yeah. from from Give time to ideas, time. For sure. Mm hmm Some more stuff. This is me kind of spoofing, uh, Iron Maiden. Iron Maiden? Yeah, doing like Iron Maiden uh, lettering for Cromwell. Okay. Okay. Very, very nice. These are some of the, this is the cover for issue number three. What is this? All right, this is the cover for issue number three of the comic book. Um, this is our character... Killer Cupid, he's mad at uh, the internet for all the dating sites because nobody falls in love the real way anymore, a natural way. So he's gonna he's going after the internet to to take it out. Oh, so he's declaring war on yeah. the internet. Yeah. Okay, works for me, man. All right. Yeah, the, I guess the internet is putting Cupid out of business. Putting him out of business, so he's mad. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the, the idea for issue number three. Yeah. Well, at least he has something to do, right? Right. This is some promo stuff, yeah, for Cromwell. Okay. Because he's a guitar player, so I got a lot of there's a lot of music references in the comic. Okay. Yeah, issue, issue two, he's got like a David Bowie, like a Ziggy Stardust thing going on for this. Okay. Yeah, he'll be like a fan favorite at rock concerts. Yeah, I'm trying to cross. So I'm a huge into music too, so I try to yeah put a lot of music stuff. Okay. Into the comic. Maybe. Um, that was the cover for issue number one. Okay. Of course, I went over budget, but. Crom Rail Green. So, yeah, that's uh, some of the characters. Yeah, Michael, you should go out to Hollywood with this, man. I'd like to, yeah, I'd love to see it as a cartoon or a like movie a, or something. Yeah, there's a few more of the characters. Okay, Michael, how would someone buy your comic editions? Like, what would they have to go through? Yeah, you can come here at A to Z. Um, I have them in stock here. And so then, they can um, come here and yeah, purchase so, them from you? Yep. Okay. And then I do sell them online too, on, uh, through Facebook and on the internet. Okay. And what is your website again? Okay. So yeah, it's, you go to Facebook and look up yeah, Melted Wax Publishing. Melted Wax Publishing. Yep. Yep, it will come up. Can they see a lot of your other cool works on there? Yeah, I got artwork on there, other stuff you can look at. Okay. Well, Mike, 
it was um fun hanging out with you. I appreciate. Yeah, man, thanks for coming in. Okay, I appreciate your time. Huh? Yeah, man. Have a good night. All right, buddy.